Well, Greenville Fashion Week is celebrating their five-year anniversary this coming April. Do you think you have what it takes to rock the runway? We're joined by Megan Hines and Kenley McVeigh from Greenville Fashion Week to tell us more about how you can audition to be a part of the show. Good to see you, ladies. Thank you for having us. Yes, we love Greenville Fashion Week, and it is the premier fashion show of the upstate, and you guys do such a great job. Megan, I don't know when you take a chance to sleep because <laughs> to put on all these shows and to do all the auditions that you guys do takes a lot of work and a big team. You've had the past two weeks. You're good. Now it's time yeah. to get back up. Yes. Yeah, no you're, problem. No big deal. Yeah, you're going um, to... Yes, we have a fantastic team, but we're so excited that auditions are just right around the corner. We have application deadlines coming up. Our kids and tweens are December the 4th, so be sure to mark your calendar for November the 22nd for those deadlines. And then 15 and up is January 7th and 8th with the deadline around the holidays, December 22nd. Well, tell people, what are we looking for when it comes to the audition? So last year, our models range anywhere from ages five to 70, so there's no age, height, or size requirement. You know, we like to see diversity on the runway. Um, when you come out to auditions, bring your confidence, bring your A-game. Um, I think Kenley can attest to the auditions. Our judges are fantastic always. Can be a little intimidating process. Confidence is key on <laughs> is the runway, it? for sure. And we I've seen Kenley confidence. work it on the <laughs> runway, so I can attest that she has what it takes to be as she is the Greenville's uh, top model. So congratulations Thank on you. that. Um, and I love, what I loved about the shows, because you see a lot of fashion shows and you're like, everyone kind of looks the same. The one thing that you made a point is to be inclusive, to see different so. body types and body, body shapes, to have different uh, faces on the runway, and that's important to you. Yes, fashion, you know, we're changing. We're not all size zero into a walk-in clothes hanger any longer. So just showcasing, you know, local boutiques carry size extra small to extra large. So I think a lot of people think that they can't come out to audition, but I encourage you to. We want to include as many sizes, shapes, and ethnicities as we possibly can. So. And what about the walk, Kinley? Because, you know, sometimes you say the confidence. Because so many people, y'all make it look so easy, like you're just going to get up and walk. But if you've ever tried to walk, and all of a sudden you're like, oh, wait, am I doing that stupid eye thing? Like, <laughs> right. You know, so what do you do? Like, how do you kind of, like, And it's yourself? almost like you don't even care. That you're just like, if I fall, I, know, I fall. Yeah. But like, oh, yeah, you know, you that's how you have to. Be. Yes. <laughs> you just have to go out there with confidence. You have to act like you own the stage, and that's the best way to do it. Is yeah. there a certain amount of like twirl you have to do, or is it like you know, give them one good twirl and then <laughs> I don't even know. It just happen to do it. She's a natural. Yeah. I try yeah. not to think about it. Yes. I just, just go out there and do What's it. What's been your favorite part of being top model so far? I know there's been probably photo shoots, and you're, of course you're promoting to the next fashion week. But uh, what has been your favorite part so far? That's a hard one because there's so much that we can do, but I've really gotten to, to enjoy getting to know the boutique owners mm -hmm. and getting to know them and get, getting to showcase what they have all throughout Greenville, and that's been really fun. I'm and sure, how yeah. fabulous is this sound? Like, no. like, yes. Well I done. I love it all. So people sitting at home that said, I think I have what it takes to be on the, on the runway, what are the, the audition dates they need to know? So go to our website, gvlfashionweek.com. The kids and tweens are December the 4th with the application deadline November 22nd. Be sure to note those deadlines. And then January 7th and 8th are 15 and up. And then those applications close on December the 22nd. Is there anything they need to bring with them? Like if you have a portfolio, should you bring it? If you don't have one, does that how does that work? So on when you go to our website, there's an online application process and you upload a headshot and full body shot. A lot of people think that they have to be professional images and they actually do not. iPhone does amazing things. Yes, yes. 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 <laughs> Yeah, that was good, <laughs> angles, right? um, but yes, they don't have to be professional photos because we'll actually take a headshot at the auditions um, for our judges to reflect back on. And then you'll turn in a five by seven photo as well when you turn in your application when you arrive at auditions. So Makes it easy. All the yes. Info. Any ideas as to what the theme is going to be next year? We do. Like, we'll be back on here. Yeah. Five years. Such a tease. I got to ask though. We got to ask, right? Yeah. Thank yes. you guys yes. so Thank much. Thank you so much Thank for having you. us. GBLFashionWeek.com for all those audition information.